All right, welcome to this Oklahoma City Thunder, my NBA franchise. I am on start today, or at least a version of it because 2K is too lazy to actually have a start today. We are taking on the OK, well, not taking on, we are the OKC Thunder. We are the 14th seed in the conference. Um, obviously, not everything's perfect, so I don't know where they are in real life. Um, I know where the Heat are, and they are first, not second. But this is the best one on PlayStation, so I mean, I'm not going to front it, if it's a few games off it is. And before we start anything, um, Josh Giddy, Untouchables. Shea Gilders, Alexander, Untouchables. Uh, trade block. Who do I want? Derry Favors on the trade block. Uh, Mike Muscala on the trade block, even though I think he might be a free agent. And those are probably the only people I probably want to be on. That Yeah, that, that seems about it. We are going to take this team and make them the way they were with Russell Westbrook, Kevin Durant. We're going to make them great again. But to start, since Shea is out, I don't know how long he's out. I didn't even know he was hurt in real life. So this is probably going to be the look of the rotation for the rest of the season. I guess I'll run a nine man. I guess I could run Derek Favors then. Do we have a big off the bench? Why is Aaron Will Wiggins guy? Eight minutes. Let's, let's see what he's up to. But I'm going to move Derek Favors uh, to the power forward position. Yep, there we go. Just so we can get those minutes. And yeah, I guess Shea's going to be out for a very long time. A uh, contract extension. I don't think Ty Jerome will resign. I don't even want you, my guy. Anyways, we're probably going to sim to the end of this season. And we'll probably do the off season in this video because why not? Anyways, let's start simulating, I guess. That happened. We ended up being the 15th seed. That works. Luka averaging 36 is the MVP. Cade Cunningham, Rookie of the Year. JaVale McGee, Sixth Man. Uh, Giannis, Defensive Player of the Year. And Fareen Simons, very well deserved. Most improved player. And Monty Williams, Coach of the Year. All NBA First Team. My main man, Jimmy Butler. Uh, Paul George, Tatum, DeJounte Murray getting the nod. DeRozan, Bam. Uh, Steph. Julius Randle made the all in. I don't know about that one, Chief. Um, Matisse Leibel, well deserved. I forgot, I gotta change. In this start today, file LeBron as a center, even though he's been playing a lot of that in real life. Uh, I don't want him playing center. And then Josh Giddy came second in, um, Rookie of the Year voting. Hey, this is this Omir Yurtsevin. Look at him. Uh, we obviously didn't make the play. The Heat were the one seed. You'll love to see it. I'm worried about the Heat more than the team I'm rebuilding here. Um, anyway, season stats. Shea Gilgis Alexander just came back from his injury. But he did not play. He ended up averaging 20. I hope it doesn't. Did not. It better not have automated the rotate. It did not. Okay, good. Um, he must have just came back then. But he averaged 27 on the season. Who are you? Who in the hell are you? Are you real? Hold on. I need to look this guy up. Holy crap. This dude's real. This dude. What is he averaging? He's averaging 5 points. How did he end up averaging 17? How many games did you play, my guy? All right. Interesting. Josh Gideon uh, averaging 16. Uh, we'll round up for him. 16, 7, and 5. Lou Dort, 15. I'm going to mess with their tendencies next season. Uh, Trey Mann averaged 12 off the bench. Darius Beige, 11. Mike Muscala, 10. And so on and so forth. So, let's get through these playoffs. The Heat get stuck with the Nets. They beat the Nets, but they're going to... The Heat won the championship. That makes me so happy on the inside. Jimmy Butler, 32, 7, 8, and 2 steals. Finals MVP. Boy, I hope that happens in real life. They, The Cavs were their only competition. That's it. The Cavs were... Oh, Heat Grizzlies finals would be amazing. But anyways, Miami Heat win the finals. That makes me a happy boy. Uh, here are all the retirements. Goran Dragic signed with the Celtics. That's actually not a bad signing for them. Um, staff retirements, Greg Popovich makes sense. Dwayne Casey, that's a bit surprising. I'm going to reject all these. Uh, max of a, maximum length. Of a, that is a terrible rule. Um, draft lottery, this is what we're here for. So we have the second pick possible. I'm going to actually watch the lottery. Uh, we have the odds of the second pick. The Hornets are going to get number 14, sixth year in the lottery. Uh, the Grizzlies... The Knicks got the 11th pick, so there must be a protection on... Nope, nope, the Grizzlies leapfrogged to four. Whose pick is that? Who picked... Well, whose pick is the Grizzlies? Was that the Lakers pick? There ain't no way. The Blazers get number 10. I gotta move Simons to the shooting guard, so Dame will actually start. Or Simons will start. The Kings, they had number 9. I wonder who the Grizzlies have. 
Whose pick do they have? Eight stays with San Antonio. We're going into the top seven now. The Indiana Pacers. It's weird seeing them in the lottery. They're never in the lottery. They end up getting a seventh pick. Nothing changes. I'll see you if something changes. Oh, the Magic. Who had the best odds for number one fall to five. Oh, don't tell. Oh, we better not fall to four. We do not. The Grizzlies. So we move to the top three. We stay in the top three, actually. Uh, that's, that is the Lakers pick. Wow, went all the way out to four. All right, so we're in the top three. We're projected number two. Can we move up? Number three pick, please. We move up to the top two where we're projected. The Rockets will be getting the third pick. It's between us and the Wizards. We are projected number two. Will we end up getting the second overall pick? We are going to have the number one pick in the NBA draft. Chet Holmgren, possibly? That's probably the best option. Chet Holmgren coming to the Oklahoma City Thunder. That's the first time in franchise history we've had the first pick. We have number one. We have number 17 and number 29. Those are all of our first round picks. That is amazing. I'm going to keep our head coach. That is not what he looks like in real life. But I'm going to keep him. Should I keep him? He doesn't have the great... He actually has pretty decent um, stats. But you know what? We're going to fire him. We're going to fire him. And we're going to... I want I want a real life coach. I don't want a fake coach. Alright, you know what? We're going to try and get David Fisdale as our next head coach. And let's see if he... Accept, he it was blocked. Yeah, it, it was It was blocked. That kind of sucks. I really, Taylor Jenkins got fired? Or is he just a free agent? I might try and pick up Taylor Jenkins. He's been doing great in real life. I can't believe they blocked us. That's some that's a bull. He's a really solid coach. Let's see if we can make this happen. Give you a 4.7. Uh, tenant, well, you better hurry up, bro. We ain't got many days. Okay, he rejected it. This is not going well. Uh, I didn't expect this to happen. Uh, we can get Mo so Maurice Cheeks is going to be our next head coach. There he is, Mo Cheeks, OKC Thunder coach. That was terrible. NBA draft. This is it. Now, are there any contracts we can get off of? Who do we got? Who do we got? Who do we got here? Uh, we got no one. Everyone's already free. I will try. I will get rid of Ty Jerome. Ty Jerome, Aaron Wiggins, and the 29th pick. Let's see if I can move up. I don't think this is gonna go through, is it? I don't. Why is trade over line on? I am not giving you another first round pick for Daniel Damn Tice. I'll give you seconds though. I want this 19th overall pick. I have a player in mind that I want, and they do agree. All right, so we got one 17 and 19. So let's resume the draft. I already think I know who I'm gonna take number one overall. Uh, Chet Holmgren is an 80. Ooh, the Hall of Fame for Jabari Smith. He can shoot the three. Huh. Chet Holmgren, DeMarcus Cousins, Hall of Fame. Is DeMarcus Cousins a Hall of Famer? That's a question. Um, but the player I was looking at was Paolo Banchero. Apparently, we didn't scout him. But Jabari Smith is looking very good. Uh, we, we, yeah, we only, I guess, um, scouted Chet Holmgren. I don't want to get Chet Holmgren, though, because... Uh, he's always... Everyone always gets Chet Holmgren. <laughs> uh, he has solid badges. He has shooting badges, too. I just, we obviously need a center. But I like Jabari Smith. I like, I like drafting Jabari Smith here. Jabari, I'm going to go Jabari. I'm just going to make it different. I don't want to get Chet. He's probably going to go number two. Jabari Smith is the first overall pick. Uh... Being offered the following trade. Oh, they want Jabari Smith for the second pick. I'm good. They're going to take Chet Holmgren. I'm going to send to our next user pick, which is number 17. Uh, I don't want to review the trade offers. I want to actually pick a player here. Let's see if the player I want is he, he is. Adrian Griffin is still here. Should I pick him up now is the question. That might be a reach. He's projected 33rd. But I think we need a center. I think we should definitely draft the big man. I'm going to draft Adrian Griffin Jr. here. We're going to sim to our next user pick, and we're going to take that center. Uh, here he, is this this isn't the guy. Who are you? Oh, you're not scouted. That's who you are. Um, so 
Oscar, not saying your last name. Welcome to the team. And that is our draft. Uh, Jabari Smith is an 80 overall. He's actually the highest rated player. Let's go to our rookie signings. Adrian Griffin ends up being a 73. This center ends up being a 70. I guess we reached there a bit, but that's fine. We got our player in Jabari Smith with the first overall pick. Uh, he, what's his three? He said it was an A+. He's got 85 three-point shot. Is it shot Tennessee? It's a 70. I don't mind that. Four finishing badges, three shooting badges, a playmaking badge, and four defensive badges. I like I like that. I want to sign all of them. On uh, team player options, he accepted his, so we're going to definitely trade Derek Williams. Derek Williams. Derek Favors. Kendrick Williams. is. We're going to accept it, but we're going to trade him. Isaiah Roby. I'm going to decline. Yeah, I'm going to decline Isaiah Roby's option. I kind of want to rebuild this team a bit. Uh, Mike Muscala. This dude, I'm not bringing back. I don't know how he averaged 17 points a game. Now, what I'm going to be looking for is stars or, like, pretty solid players that um, might not return. To, like, Miles Bridges is getting offered $32 million. The Pistons are probably going to pick him up. But I, I don't think I'd stretch to give Miles that much. Uh, but play, there's not many players here, to be honest, that are, like, worth throwing money to. Like, honestly, I'd probably throw Victor Oladipo some money to come off our bench to be our sixth man. Mo Bamba, I'd throw money to to be our starting center for next year. So, Ty Jones is 80 overall. He's only 26 still. So, looking at our roster, uh, I think, wh where is um, Adrian Griffin? Uh, he might be our backup shooting guard. I might keep him there. Because we still got Kenny Hustle, who I might end up trading. Oh, he goes up to a 75. I'm going to move the small forward. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do a more realistic trade. I know it seems like I am giving up a lot, but it's more of a salary dump than anything, even though we have plenty of money. But I'm going to give Justice Winslow another chance here in Oklahoma City. We're going to be sending Kendrick Williams and Derek Favors over to the Blazers, who have absolutely no one. Uh, and they, they should agree to that trade. I am actually going to fix them right now. Russell Westbrook is here. You know what? He has no offers. I'm bringing Russell Westbrook back to OKC. Not for $12 million, though. We have the money. I'm bringing Russell Westbrook back to OKC. I'm bringing Russell Westbrook back to OKC. I'm doing it. Mo Bamba and Russell Westbrook. Uh, we're going to reannounce the rights on all these guys. Last day moratorium. We get both Russell Westbrook back. And we sign Mo Bamba. Russell Westbrook, the sixth man. Back where it all started. Hopefully, he'll probably end his career here. 79 overall, man. That's so sad. But he is back. Oh, my God. I switched teams. And our center is now Mo Bamba and Pokazevsky. I think our team is set for next season. It's going to be a developing year. We're definitely not going to make any noise. I do want to... Oh, is he gone? Do I not have enough money for Old Depot now? Oh, no. He's gone. He's actually just gone. Okay. That's fine by me. I don't really care that much. And now we have enough players on our roster. Okay, let's go to player progression here. Westbrook's probably going to get worse. He definitely got worse. He's not over here. Shea's an 89. Josh Giddey's an 81. Mo Bamba is an 81. He's our third best player. Jabari Smith obviously didn't move. Baisley got better. Pokazevsky got better. Oh, my God, Westbrook. Westbrook's a 76 overall. My God. Winslow went down because we switched his position. That makes sense. All right, here's what the rotation is going to look like. We got Shea. Josh Giddy, Lou Dort, Jabari Smith, Mo Bamba. That was we already knew that was gonna be the starting lineup. On the bench, we got Darius Baisley, Russell Westbrook, um, Pokasevsky, um, Adrian Griffin Jr., and Justice Winslow wrapping up our bench. Uh, I forgot we have Mo Cheeks as our um coach. Let's hope he's not Cheeks. I just smashed my controller and hit the wrong button. Uh Shea is gonna be our number one scoring option. I'm gonna put Josh Giddy and Jabari Smith. Um, as our options there. And let's simulate our first game against the Los Angeles Lakers. First, let's see who went where, uh, free agency-wise. Same. All right, so nothing really changed. Uh, so we're going to simulate this first game against the Lakers. We lose by three. We're on at 24. Josh Giddy with 21, 8, and 5. He shot terrible, though. Westbrook off the bench, 6 for 9. Would you love to see? We're going to simulate, I want to say, a week or two into the season. Oh, I'm going to disable this because I don't care. Wow, we lost two straight. I didn't expect the team to be competitive, but Westbrook didn't miss a shot in this game. Shea had 28. We couldn't stop Luka, though. Could not stop Luka. Can we get a win? Can we, like, get a win? Nope, nope. I, I won't end this video until we get a win. Westbrook finally has a bad shooting game. Okay. I won't end this video until we get a win. 
have one or more players with an unplayable injury. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Josh Giddy just got hurt. Why did it not tell me that? Why did it not tell me Josh Giddy got hurt? Well, how? What, what happened? Uh, oh, he's got finger fracture or whatever. All right, well, there goes Josh Giddy. Uh, do we start Westbrook? <laughs> I might. I'm just gonna start Adrian Griffin. I don't know how he's playing. Bad, terrible. Westbrook, you're in the starting lineup, buddy. You're in the starting lineup. We we lost Josh Giddy. He's getting propelled right back in. Just when they thought you could pull you out, put you right back in. Uh, Russell Westbrook, you're gonna be getting in like 32 minutes. I'll give you. All right, we got the rotation stat. Let's see what Westbrook does in his first game as a starter. We lost again. We have yet to win. But Westbrook, 14, 3, and 10 on decent shooting. I will take it. I'm not ending this until, oh my God, we cannot win a game. Westbrook had an amazing game. We cannot win. I'm not ending this until we win a game. I refuse. I refuse to end this until we win a game. Please, we won a game. We beat the Houston Rockets for our first win of the season. Oh my god, this was a Mo Bamba game. Westbrook has been pretty damn good this season, to be honest. Uh, what's his stats as a starter? Uh, as a starter, he's averaging 17 points, 3 rebounds, 6 assists, on 54% shooting, and 40% from 3. Good job, Westbrook. Uh, see, well, I'm just going to simulate the rest of this week, and then we'll see the season stats uh, three weeks into the season. Oh my god, we are so bad. We are 1-8. One 1-8 and eight. One and eight to start the season. Uh, player stats before I end this video. 27 for Shea. 15, 8, and 2 for Mo Bamba. And we have him on a steal of a contract. I think I have a team. Yup, $10 million team option for three years. He has been amazing. 15 points, 8 rebounds, 2 blocks. On 50% from the field, 36 from 3. Westbrook, 14 points, 4 rebounds, 6 assists. On 58% shooting. Another steal of a player. He's gonna. I don't know why I signed him to such a long deal. He's gonna regress so much. He's gonna. He's gonna end up retiring, to be honest. Uh, but we have him on a decent contract. I mean, I don't know how long he'll be here. Uh, Jabari Smith, the rookie, eleven points, seven rebounds, a steal, shooting pretty decent. I'll take it. Darius Baisley off the bench, ten. Lou Dora has been terrible. Why is your number different? Oh, I guess Mobamba took it. Lou Dort has been awful. Oh my god, our bench. Josh Giddy was playing bad too before he got hurt. Justice Winslow's playing good. Our bench is bad. Anyways, that's gonna be it for me. Leave a like, guys, did enjoy. Subscribe, if you guys are new. See you.